that door. My dearest Kendra, what a ride these last almost six years have been. I remember the time I took you home to light up night in Indiana, and the next time I was talking to my parents, my mom said, you know, Dale, I think she could be the one. I thought, well, maybe. I mean, her family does own a large farm with plenty of deer to shoot after all. Little did I know this was just the beginning of the best years of my life. Someone I could spend my life with and grow with was my ultimate dream. And while I knew for a while that you were the one I could see spending my life with, it was through the loss of Kayla that I realized that you were the one I wanted to do all of the unbelievably hard things in life with. Who would have thought after having our first kiss on the Joe's dance floor that we'd end up here? Our relationship has grown more than I could have ever imagined since that day. I continue to be in awe of your ambition, intelligence, and kindness towards not only me, but everyone around us. When I think back to six years ago before we met, I dreamed of the life that we currently have. I dreamed of starting a family with, of course, a dog baby first. I dreamed of having a husband that was not only my best friend, but the best person I know. I vow to always love you with everything I am, to be your sounding board when life gets tough again, and it will at some point. I vow to to never give up on us no matter what our future may hold. Through thick and thin, I will always be there for us. I vow to always do the cleaning when you're coming off a work stretch so that you can come home and unwind in a fairly clean house even though it may not be up to your standards sometimes. Overall, I vow to be the absolute best version of me I can be for you, us, and our future family. Let's have an absolutely amazing wedding with our friends and family and let's enjoy it to the fullest. I love you so incredibly much and I cannot wait to dive into this next chapter hit first with the woman of my dreams by my side. Today, I promise to continue to look at our lives as a dream come true. I promise to be your biggest motivator, your constant supporter, and your shoulder to lean on. I promise to always try, no matter how hard life gets. I promise to laugh with you, travel with you, and just live life with you. I promise to cherish you and this love we have forever, but most importantly, I promise to be your home just like you are mine. This is a day of great celebration and reverence on which we come together before friends and family and God to recognize and commemorate the sacred love and dedication shared between these two people. I do take you, Kendra, for my lawfully wedded wife. I, Kendra, take you, Dale, for my lawfully wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or worse, for richer or poorer, I promise to be true to you, in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. Until death do us part, this is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. I do give you this ring as a symbol of my love and commitment. With this ring, I thee wed. I, Kendra, give you this ring as a symbol of my love and commitment. With this ring, I thee wed. I now pronounce you as husband and wife. Dale, please kiss your bride. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Dale and Kendra Pierce. Once I got to know Dale, I realized how great of a guy he was and how actually happy Kendra was. 
When she told me they were moving in together, it was rather quickly, I could tell that she was very serious about him. I just want to wish you both the best of luck, and I cannot wait to see where your marriage and life takes you. I love you both, and I can't wait to continue to celebrate you guys. I'm proud of the man my brother's grown up to be. I think he's chosen an amazing partner to do life with, with Kendra. I have no doubt with each other, they'll overcome whatever life throws at them. Yeah.